The snow falling across West Michigan this week, nothing compared to what happened 45 years ago today. That was the infamous blizzard of 1978 that left pictures like this all across the region with streets buried in snow, cars overcome with the drifts, people stranded across the region. Some of the video from the WZZM archives took a look at this a big snowblower there cutting through those drifts that are almost as tall as that machine itself. Over the course of this storm, about 20 people unfortunately lost their lives in the state of Michigan, closer to 100 across the country. We saw wind speeds that went up close to uh, 50 plus here in West Michigan around the country as high as 111 over Lake Erie. This storm left its mark all across the region. So what exactly happened with this system? Well, here's what we were looking at on the 25th. There were two low pressure systems. One was further to the south. One was up toward Minnesota. As we worked our way into the 26, these two systems combined. This particular low pressure system went under Bombo Genesis, which is at least a 24 uh, millibar drop in terms of the pressure in 24 hours, strengthening that storm, producing those wicked winds across the region and dropping just an impressive amount of snow totals. In fact, snow totals from in West Michigan as high as 33.8 inches in Grand Rapids, Eaton Rapids 20 seven inches Montague 24 and in Grand Haven we had 24 inches of that snowfall as well. Really a big snowmaker across the region and a storm that many will never forget.